Hello, your tick admin here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to edit videos uh, with Kaden Live that come from uh, Record My Desktop. Edit videos that you make with Record My Desktop with Kaden Live. Um, by default, this usually doesn't work because um, Record My Desktop outputs uh, and um, OV OGV file which uh, Kaden Live doesn't play nicely with. It usually crashes and even if you get it imported into Kaden Live uh, it's really glitchy and the video just doesn't do well even there, in there. Even though Kaden Live says it supports um, the Vorbis Dior format it, it doesn't do a very good job with it. So you know a simple way around this is to just convert the video to an AVI and the simplest way to do this is to go to your terminal and type sudo app dash git install mincoder hit enter type in your password password um, it's gonna ask you if you want to install here it's gonna say Y or N just press Y it's like a 10 megabyte download it shouldn't take very long at all and once you have it downloaded you're gonna need one command and I'll show you that command it is I don't know it by memories, but uh, here it is right here. I have it saved. Um, by default, record my desktop outputs um, an out.ogv file to your home folder. So uh, this is what I have that optimized for. Um, what it's going to do is, um, since you start terminal in your home folder, and that's where record my desktop outputs to, I have it set to if you open your terminal and you haven't changed where record my desktop saves to or you haven't changed uh, the video's name then it should work on this with the exception that if um, you have a couple of videos from record my desktop uh, already recorded then you're gonna have to add um, dash one or dash two to this video right here this file right here this little area is the um, input file name so if it's like if this is the second or third video, you're just gonna have to look in your home folder and see what the uh, video file's name is, and then just rename it dash one or dash two or dash two hundred, whatever it is. Um, but by default, if you've just recorded one video, um, then this is all you have to do: just copy, paste, and hit enter. I'm gonna have this in the video description, and I'm gonna go ahead and encode um, uh, an OGV file I have in my home folder already using this. As you can see, um, it's a really fast encoder, um, but it's going to—it's of course going to go slower with larger files. Uh, this is a relatively small file, but um, as you can see, it's done now. So I'm going to go to my home folder and um, there you can see the new output output file. It's an AVI format. It's lossless, which means the um, the new video has the exact same quality as the OGV file as you can see it's still a really high quality video alright so now that you have your AVI file you can basically just uh, add this into Kaden Live uh, home. grab the AVI file and as you can see it does very well with it um, Hold on. There we go. And there you can see it's working just fine. <laughs> and my laptop's dying. But anyway, um, that's basically it. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Um, Kitten Live is a very powerful video editor in Linux. Um, it's about the most powerful. I'm, I'm actually pretty confident to say it is the most powerful Linux video editor. Um, aside from using Blender or something, but you have to load a lot of stuff to use Blender to edit videos. So, um, there you have it. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. Um, again, this code right here is going to be in the description. Uh, thanks for watching, and until next time, guys.